eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and lift off. The next destination we we perceive as being the moon, around the moon, uh, building an outpost, a deep space gateway around the moon. Uh, and for Canada, the challenge right now and the opportunity is to define what our contribution could be to uh, humanity's next, uh, next step in human exploration. So for Canada, I mean, the natural element we can bring to the table are, is robotics. A large manipulator that's going to be needed on the Deep Space Gateway to assemble, uh, to uh, grapple and bird spacecraft, essentially the Orion or other spacecraft that will come to the Deep Space Gateway, defining the various systems, the essential systems that will compose this small space station around the Moon. We're expanding human presence around the Moon, possibly to the surface of the Moon, the ultimate destination for all partners, for all space agencies composing the ISEC-G is Mars. Bonjour tout le monde. If you ask Jenny and Joshua, and we didn't make any promises to them, the expectation is that they will fly uh, to the ISS and beyond in the 2020s. And again, th there are many unknowns right now, and that, that's part of the challenge. Uh, uh, but certainly, we selected two new astronauts, we doubled the Canadian Corps of Astronauts. Our intention, our goal in everything we do is to identify flights for Jenny and Joshua. 